Hey, everybody. Thanks for stopping by the sandbox. If you don't mind, click that subscribe button. Click that like button. We're going to talk about some AMC, some GME, some Sundial, and possibly something else that might be fun in the news. So without any further ado, let's get going. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it was just another one of those bloodbaths today in the old stock market. As you can see here, AMC started out, well, she had a nice little ping up, but then it was all the way down, standing a little run out, but she kind of barcoded out for the day. Uh, we ended up closing at $11.48. That's down 7.64%. to a loss of 95 cents, ladies and gentlemen. But I'm going to tell you what. This is setting up to be a beast. Uh, I feel it. I think a lot of people are starting to feel this. Um, I mean, Charles Payne even tweeted out, uh, is the market set up for a short squeeze? Uh, I'm telling you, these guys are taking their money out. I, I think they've been told uh, from the top, they've got to get themselves out of this position. And um, I think they're selling off to pay off. So everybody hang in there, ladies and gentlemen. I think the time's near. We're going to start seeing a lot of these meme stocks bouncing up. Um, Redbox has already had a little run, but, uh, I mean, that's nothing compared to what we're about ready to see. Uh, and, of course, we all know AMC is the mother of all short squeezes coming. Are you ready? Let's take a look at GME here. She also had a little good little bounce up. Uh, Took a little run down. She also kind of just kind of just cruised along during the day here. She ended up closing at $118.25. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, that is a loss of 8.4%. And that is a deficit of $10.84 today, ladies and gentlemen. But again, GameStop set itself up for a big short squeeze along with the rest of this market. Ladies and gentlemen, I think we're about ready. It's going to be a volatile week. Hang in there. Then our favorite greenery here just took it down. She kind of made it back there around lunchtime. And then she kind of just barcoded out for the rest of the day. Ladies and gentlemen, Sundial also down 8.76%. That's a loss of two cents. She's down to 30 cents, ladies and gentlemen. 30 cents a share, 30 cents a share, going once, going twice. I'm telling you, this might not be a bad buy. Bottom line is the stock market's supposed to be democratized. Everyone's supposed to be able to take a shot. And if you, and if you get burned, you get burned. That's what the stock market is. It's a free market exchange. I think it's going higher. You think it's going lower. Let's play by the same rules. So I don't think that these platforms did this for the little guy. I really believe they circled the wagons to help the hedge funds who control Wall Street, who, by the way, buy the order flow from Robin Hood. So they didn't do this to save the little guy. You don't, you don't seduce people into trading by giving them free stock and these commercials and talking about the beauty of investing. And then when you have the biggest folks on Wall Street right there ready to crack, pull a rug out from under those same people you seduce yeah. into the market. It's a shame. It really is. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time. Click that subscribe button. Click that like button. We need to get more subscribers to this channel. We need more people in this movement, a positive movement to move forward. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll see you next time. Hug somebody you don't know. Peace.